Hey guys, welcome to week two of Vlogger Tag. It is Monday, which means you're back with me, John Ray. It is May 22nd, I believe, 2017, and uh, we're kicking off our second week. Uh, we've had intros from a few of the guys. I'm going to do a little responding to those and uh, touch on some of the themes that we started, and hopefully we'll just keep the ball rolling from there. Um, I'm here in Arapica Sand Hills Preserve in Pasco County, uh, just south of the Pasco, or the Pasco Hernando County line. Uh, off of Route 19. So it's uh, pretty peaceful here. It's uh, not one of the larger preserves in the area, but uh, there's usually not too much of a crowd, only a couple people here this Monday evening. So um, really nice, the weather held out. We had some thunder uh, rolling through earlier, but uh, I think the, the blue skies will hold out long enough for us to at least shoot a video. Um, some of the things we had talked about as uh, the guys did their intros were uh, um, their hobbies, things they like to do. So uh, we'll kind of like keep that theme rolling and um, see how it goes. Uh, the first video I watched was um, Eric's. Uh, he responded uh, with uh, so his own intro to talk a little bit about himself, which uh, was nice to hear and uh, talked about some of his hobbies he's just getting into. Which I think one of them was wood burning, which I know nothing about, but um, maybe further down the line we'll, he'll share some of those as he you know, does uh, some work with that and has uh, a little more experience and whatever. And um, another thing he's mentioned is that uh, this is kind of weird, just vlogging for the first time. And yeah, I agree. Uh, it's strange sitting here just talking to your uh, camera or computer as it is in my case. And uh, I thought that everybody this week did a good job and um, I'm going to keep, you know, hopefully getting better and more used to it. And uh, that'll be cool that we'll at the end of a year, see this evolution of where we started and hopefully, you know, where we are uh, another 50 odd weeks from now. So that'll be cool. Um, another one of his hobbies was uh, video games. I gotta be honest, I haven't played video games much in more than a decade. So um, back in early college, I was playing a lot of Tony Hawk Pro Skater 2, 3, whatever. Um, but since then, I haven't, so I'd be interested in knowing like what people play. I know there's a lot of the uh, strategy games that are really large. Um, uh, the MMORPGs morphed into like even bigger, larger things like uh, the StarCraft and whatever um, after uh, World of Warcraft. These are all things I've seen and I hear about and I vaguely know what they are, but no idea. Uh, maybe it's not even that popular anymore. Whatever. Uh, look forward to hearing more about that from Eric. Um, uh, another thing he had mentioned is that he shoots, I mentioned it just now that I'm uh, recording on a laptop, but he shoots on his uh, uh, Canon T3, which uh, is something I've gotten into recently. I got my first DSLR uh, recently and uh, my first extra lens this week in the mail. Um, I'm getting into hopefully a, a new hobby of uh, shooting um, some photography, landscapes and stuff. I did a, a model photo shoot yesterday. Uh, uh, we'll see how those turn out. I haven't really looked through the photos yet, uh, yet. but um, yeah, that's uh, I'm shooting actually a older model than what uh, Eric had mentioned. This is a Canon uh, Rebel XS, so uh, pretty basic. Picked it up for about 150 bucks um, with the 18 to 55 lens on it. But um, yeah, that's something I look forward to, and I'll be sharing hopefully some photos that uh, I'll be proud of eventually uh, as as the year moves forward. So that's uh, uh, one of my hobbies. That, I'll uh, hopefully be able to, to bring out and uh, share with everybody. Uh, after watching Eric's intro video, I watched Mike's, and uh, he mentioned being originally from Wisconsin and then moved to Oklahoma, I think, and I can relate to that, getting out of the snow. I'm from Ohio originally, so I am an Ohioan. I don't miss the snow. I don't know if a Wisconsinite, Wisconsinian, whatever, however you call yourselves if you miss the snow at all. Um, other than snow sports, snowboarding, I don't really miss the, uh, the snow up north. But um, uh, I definitely enjoy the, the warmth down here. Uh, I just heard some fish jumping in the background. But uh, I do kind of uh, miss the change of seasons, I guess, would be the only thing that I really miss. Um, and that brings to mind um, why I uh, uh, am interested in being here on this location is that I, I want to explore um, out of the places I've lived, I grew up in Ohio and did plenty of exploring there. I was there for 25 years or so growing up and uh, going to college. But uh, after that, I lived around New York City area and I did some exploring, but I was pretty busy working and stuff and I didn't you know, take in nearly what that city has to offer. I spent a few years overseas. I lived in Seoul. I 
did a lot of exploring there and other countries in Southeast Asia. But again, you get so busy, you forget to uh, enjoy the things around you. So hopefully this year I'm dedicating a little bit of extra time to uh, enjoying the natural wonders around me. And, um, and that'll be nice that if I do move from here someday that I'll at least say, hey, did my best to, to cover those things. Um, as far as your hobby, you mentioned you're going on a canoe trip. That sounds awesome. Um, I wish you the best of luck and safety as well. And hopefully you take some pictures that you'll be able to uh, share with us when you get back from the trip. Um, we do uh, a bit of kayaking down here. There's the uh, Wikiwachi River uh, just north of where I am now, which is uh, a beautiful crystal clear river that comes out of the ground at 72 degrees year round. It's just gorgeous. Um, looking forward to doing that hopefully again soon as the, uh, um, as the uh, uh, weather, you know, it's going to be gorgeous, I think, for the next few days at least. So we'll see if I can get out this week. Um, if not, I'll definitely try and get some landscapes here to, uh, for pictures for, for us to look at for uh, the next video. Um, Rich Hawaiian Shirt Santa, as I will call him, uh, for this video at least. Uh, that's, uh, um, I enjoyed his uh, follow-up to his original. Um, and thank you to Rich for the compliments on my own video. Uh, the confidence boost definitely helps uh, when you're shooting one of these videos. Um, and I, uh, not only did I get a kick out of your shirt, which is, I used to have uh, quite a few Hawaiian shirts which are no longer with me, so I'll leave it to you for this uh, video series of, um, of weblogs. But um, uh, like everybody else said, um, this can be difficult, so I uh, appreciate the uh, confidence boost. And um, as far as your hobbies went, uh, you had talked about how uh, you love riding your Harley, and I can imagine it's more fun than even just the uh, riding you know, a pedal bike as I do. Um, but it's dangerous, and that's true uh, of any type of biking in Florida, that we don't really have a, a lot of um, uh, priority for safety on the roads. And you see the bumper stickers that say, beware of bikes and watch out for motorcycles. But honestly, I know that it's dangerous out there on the, on the road for a motorcycle, as it is, I know several people recently injured on bicycles because we don't have really a lot of uh, marked bicycle lanes. However, we do have some good off-road uh, trails or paved that are um, separate from the road, I should say, not off-road. Uh, the Suncoast uh, Trail that follows the Veterans Highway is uh, one of the local ones that is uh, really cool. It goes from somewhere north of where I am now down to Tampa. It's like 46, 50 miles, something like that, uh, which is great that we've got um, uh, those things that you can get away from uh, the traffic and be safe riding, running, rollerblading, whatever it is. Um, uh, I think that the, uh, the Santa Beard and the charity thing that you mentioned, uh, uh, you uh, donate your time in the uh, come of the holidays is uh, another awesome thing. I hope to get involved with some, um, you know, if not charities and events, foundations, anything to get involved and kind of, you know, uh, give back in the community is uh, a wonderful thing to, um, to be able to do if you've got that time and capacity to help others. Uh, that's uh, an admirable quality, so that, uh, I think that's great. Um, other than that, I uh, look forward to everybody's comments, thoughts, questions, anything uh, that they have want to throw back at me, and uh, I'll pick it up from there next week. Probably going to have to trim this video down a little bit, so uh, we'll see how much of it actually makes the final cut. But uh, until next Monday, thank you all, and I'll see you in seven days. Yeah.